strong fire has broken out in a forested area in Turkey's Izmir city, local media reported on Friday. Fire started in Shandarli neighborhood of Izmir's Dikili district at around 14.20 local time for an unknown reason. Firefighting operations are underway. Four planes, five helicopters, eleven water tankers, five water supply vehicles, three bulldozers, and two crews of firefighters have been dispatched in the area from the Izmir Forestry Regional Directorate. Residents are being evacuated from the Mavacant site ere the flames were approaching due to the fire spreading because of strong wind. The Shandarli Deniskoy Highway has been closed to traffic due to the fire. Multiple wildfires have erupted across Turkey recently due to hot weather. Moscow to pay residents over $21,000 signing bonus for joining army, Russia lacks troops. Moscow Mayor Sergei Sobyanin signed a decree on July the 23rd establishing a one-time signing bonus of 1.9 million rubles or $21,200 for city residents who join the military. As Russia has sought to replenish its military decimated by high losses in Ukraine, authorities have implemented financial perks to incentivize enlistment. While other regional authorities have also instituted signing bonuses such as 1 million rubles or $11,200 in Krasnodar Krai and 500,000 rubles or 5,600 in Dagestan, the Moscow signing bonus appears to be the highest reported so far. With the addition of the signing bonus, a Moscow resident who enlists in the army will make over 5.2 million rubles or $58,600 over the course of their first year in service, Sobyanin's office said. Servicemen can also receive between 500,000 to 1 million rubles or $5,600 to $11,200 for being injured, and the family of a soldier killed in action is reportedly set to be paid 3 million rubles or $34,000. A variety of other perks are also offered to family members, the mayor's office said. Russia's Federal Statistics Service, Rostat, said in June 2023 that the average monthly wage across the country was around 65,000 rubles or $735. In comparison with the additional signing bonus factored, a Moscow resident could earn 433,000 rubles a month or $4,800 in their first year serving in the army. Experts say that Russia lacks the munitions and soldiers needed to launch a new major offensive in Ukraine. Russia's new May offensive in northeastern Kharkiv Oblast has effectively ground to a halt, but Moscow's troops maintain their pressure in Donetsk Oblast, pushing into the town of Chasiv Yar. Ukrainian defenses have improved significantly, albeit also suffering heavy losses. It will take some time before Kyiv accumulates enough resources to launch its own counter-offensive.